Hey everybody, Mungo Dark Matter here and welcome to Dark Matters. Today on Dark Matters I'm going to show you how to use an Xbox controller with Windows 10 edition of Minecraft. Alright, now if we go into settings right here you'll actually see down here it says controller and that's an Xbox controller right here. Now obviously the first thing you have to do to for this to work is you have to connect your controller to your PC. If you have a wired controller, it should work with either a 360 or an Xbox One controller re relatively easily, particularly if you have Windows version 7 and above. It should automatically install the driver and run. It's a little more complicated if you want to use a wireless controller. You're going to have to get a uh, wireless adapter for your PC and then set up your controller with that. All right, so let's get started. Just to bring to your attention here, there are a couple of things in here. If your controller supports vibrate, you can turn this on so that when you uh, destroy a block, the controller will vibrate. If it supports vibrating, you don't want it to, you can just turn it off. Another thing you may want to turn on, which is off by default, is auto jump. Auto jump will uh, have you jump up over, like if you hit a one level block, Instead of having to hit jump, you'll automatically jump up over it. All right, so let's go and uh, hop into this world and see how this thing works. All right. As you can see right here, I'm moving around using the controller, and I'm using the uh, joystick on the controller, which is to the or to my extreme left up at the top of the controller and that controls your movement. The uh, joystick which is down to the bottom right controls your view so if you want to look up and down you can use that. If you uh, press in the uh, joystick to the upper left it changes like if, whether you see yourself from the back or the front or whether you see it first person view. Say you wanted to pick up the pickaxe. Pick what you do is you use the bumper buttons to uh, cycle through your selection on your toolbar. So wherever you stop, that's what you're holding. And then you can continue walking around. And you note when I hit this block here, I'm hopping up automatically. All right, to get to inventory, all we do is hit Y. Uh, you can uh, move around uh, what block is highlighted or what part of the grid is highlighted using your left joystick. And if you, you're on something to take it, you just press A. And to place it, you move it to where you want to go and you hit A again. So if we take this block of wood and hit A, it will make uh, four um, oak wood planks for us and we can hit A again on that and take that and place it down wherever we want to place it. Let's make a crafting table real quickly. Now I'm going to take half of this stack by hitting X. Move it one here. Move one there and then I'm going to take half of this stack again and put the last one there and so we have a crafting table. So I can pick that up and select that and pop it down here. Then if I hit the B it gets me out again. I hit the bumper button until I get to the crafting table. I can set the crafting table down by uh, hitting the left trigger button. And if I have the uh, crafting table selected or where the cursor is and hit left trigger, it brings up the crafting table. So then I can uh, build things using the crafting table itself. For example, I can, uh, I can uh, pick up these blocks again, put them down, pick them up, and then place them. like so, and then I can create another pickaxe. 
and I can pick that up as well. And once again, I hit B to exit there. So that's how you can use an Xbox controller in the Windows 10 edition of Minecraft. I'm Mungo Dark Matter, and this has been Dark Matters, and whatever you do, enjoy playing Minecraft. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.